I'm at the front of the car and uh, under is uh, I already removed the, the cover right here the cover and one more remaining but uh, I didn't uh, yeah, I did not able to remove it since it's okay to swing like that and then the radiator drain bulb is located over here where is it? right there radiator drain bulb it needs a Phillips screwdriver to open the top I'm gonna get the Phillips screwdriver right here already have the three gallons of 50-50 uh, pre-diluted and I need this one when I drain it so that the remaining water in there is gonna go in this pan let's see over right here And now it's uh, totally empty. I'm gonna use the garden hose to hose it down with water. Let's see. Another one. Maybe different setting. This one. Or I'm gonna remove the nozzle or I can do this one also Close it down Ooh. There's a little, uh, a little bit more uh, dripping water but uh, when you put it back you put it back over here the, this is the top use a Phillips screwdriver to tighten up uh, 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 clock, it's gonna be clockwise over here Not so tight, not too loose. Yes, good enough. That's not turning anymore. The panel over here. Right here. Now it's ready to fill. I bought uh, three gallons right there uh, in case, but uh, I think it's uh, gonna fit only about uh, two and a half gallons. Now, ready to feel. Make sure the funnel is clean. So that the dirt is not gonna go into your uh, radiator. I hose it with water a while ago. So for sure it's already clean. Uh -oh. <laughs>